This story is a work of fiction. Similarities between characters or events to persons living or dead in your world are purely coincidental. Only those who have agreed to the above have the privilege of partaking in this game. The contract has been sealed. The world is not as it should be. It's filled with distortion, and ruin can no longer be avoided. Those who oppose fate and desire change. From time to time, they were referred to as tricksters. You are the trickster. Now is the time to rise against the abyss of distortion. Now get running! This is our only chance! Stay calm! You can get away now! We'll retrieve the briefcase on our end. <laughs> what was that? Don't worry about us. Just concentrate on getting away.
on, man. I'm okay. No problems at all. Where'd they go, damn it? I can't confirm the injury report. Huh? What? to find some kid. You have your teammate to thank for this. You were sold out. Suspect confirmed. Cuff it. The drug was too strong. Wake him up. No dozing off. You still don't get it, do you? Give it up! <laughs> Come on, cooperate. What? You want another shot? Huh? What about the camera? Are you thinking it can be used as video evidence? Didn't you hear my question? Answer! <coughs> Obstruction of justice. Blackmail, defamation, possession of weapons. Manslaughter too, yeah? Talk about the works. To think that all those crimes were led by a punk like this. And you seem to be enjoying every second of it. Huh? should know your place.
sign here. It's a confession under your name. Don't expect to walk out of here in one piece. We are going to make you understand. One must take full responsibility for their actions. Excuse me, but this area is off. I'm Nijima from the Public Prosecutor's Office. The Prosecutor's Office? What business do you have here? Just let me through. It's urgent. There's something I need to confirm with the suspect. Nijima-san, I believe this case is no longer in your jurisdiction. Besides... You Prosecutor Sai Nijima? There's a call from your director. Hurry and get it over with. To be frank, you're being an inconvenience. you to stand by. I'm responsible for this case, yet I'm not even being allowed an interrogation? I'm calling because I knew you'd bring it up. I will not be convinced unless I confirm it for myself. This is my case. Uh, good luck to you then. I won't be expecting much though. Uh, Prosecutor, I forgot to mention something important. Your time will be cut short. We can't permit you to talk with him for long. <sighs> it's for your own sake. His methods are unknown. After all, we don't even know if it's safe to simply meet and speak with him. I understand. I didn't expect it'd be you. You'll be answering my questions this time. Can you hear me? It seems you've been through a lot. Almost anything can happen here. And I can't stop them. That's why I need you to answer me honestly. I don't have much time either. What was your objective? Why did you cause such a major incident? I didn't think it was a prank from the get-go, but I couldn't assemble a case for prosecution. It's because I couldn't figure out the method behind it. True. There's no way I could be convinced of such a world just by reading the reports. It seems you're coherent. When and where did you find out about that world? How is it even possible to steal another's heart? Now, tell me your account of everything. Start from the very beginning. Gentlemen, thank you for writing. 
with us today. We will be arriving in Shibuya shortly. This is the last stop for this line. Please transfer here for all subway lines. The doors to your left will open. <laughs> Please, help! Damn brat! I'll sue! What? Are you for real? A mental shutdown? It's the truth! To a person, though? It's gotta be a joke. You really love all that occult stuff, don't you? <laughs> transit bus was driven down an opposing lane with its customers still in it. The citizens can't live in peace if this keeps up. Oh, how frightening. What could be going on? 
Didn't something similar happen just the other day? Hmm. Vertical is the name of a shellfish used for farming pearls. Oh, right. They did say that was today. Well, we'll be going now. The payment's on the table. Thanks for coming. Uh, this place is in the back alley, so there's no worries of a car crashing in here. A what now? There's been a string of those rampage accidents, you know. I just hope that none happen around here. It's none of my concern. <laughs> well, see you next time. Oh, four hours for just a single cup of joe. So, you're the guy. Uh-huh. I'm Sojiro Sakura. You'll be in my custody over the next year. I was wondering what kind of unruly kid would show up. But you're the one, huh? Have you been told? A customer of mine and your parents know each other, and... Well, not that that matters. Follow me. This is your room. I'll at least give you sheets for your bed. Hmm? You look like you want to say something. It's on you to clean up the rest. I'll be leaving after I lock up each day. You'll be alone at night, but don't do anything stupid. I'll throw you out if you cause any trouble. Now then. I got the gist of your situation. You protected some woman from a man forcing himself on her, he got injured, then sued you, right? That's what you get for sticking your nose in a matter between two adults. You did injure him, yeah? And now that you've got a criminal record, you were expelled from your high school. The courts ordered you to transfer and move out here, which your parents also approved. In other words, they got rid of you for being a pain in the ass. It's best you not talk about anything unnecessary. I am in the restaurant business, you know. Behave yourself for the year. If nothing happens, your probation will be lifted. Cause any problems and you'll be sent straight to Juvie. We'll be going to Shujin tomorrow. Shujin Academy, the school you'll be attending. We'll introduce ourselves properly to the staff there. There's rarely a place to accept someone like you, you know? What a waste of my Sunday. Your luggage arrived earlier. I left them over there. Seriously. Uh-huh. I'm gonna head back then.
brat! I'll sue! You're worth causing me trouble, huh? I'll... I'll call the police! <laughs> call them if you want. The police are my bitches. They're not gonna take you seriously. No! Stop! Someone called the cops, huh? Get in the car! Incompetent fools like you just need to shut your mouths and follow where I steer this country. What are you looking at? Get out of my face! This ain't a show. Get lost, kid. See? This is all because you're so damn slow. Get in the car! Trickster, welcome to my velvet room. So you've come too, inmate. The you in reality is currently fast asleep. You are only experiencing this as a dream. You're in the presence of our master. Stand up straight! Welcome. I am delighted to make your acquaintance. This place exists between dream and reality, mind and matter. It is a room that only those who are bound by a contract may enter. I am Igor, the master of this place. Remember it well. I summoned you to speak of important matters. It involves your life as well. Still, this is a surprise. The state of this room reflects the state of your own heart. To think a prison would appear as such. You truly are a prisoner of fate. In the near future, there is no mistake that ruin awaits you. I speak of the end to everything. However, there is a means to oppose such a fate. You must be rehabilitated, rehabilitated toward freedom. 
That is your only means to avoid ruin. Do you have the resolve to challenge the distortion of the world? You didn't decline, hmm. Very well, that is enough. Allow me to observe the path of your rehabilitation. Ah, pardon me for not introducing the others. To your right is Caroline. To your left, Justine. They serve as wardens here. Ha! Try and struggle as you like! The duty of wardens is to protect inmates. We are also your collaborators. That is, if you remain obedient. I shall explain the roles of these two at another occasion. Now then, it seems the night is waning. It is almost time. Take your time to slowly come to understand this place. We will surely meet again, eventually. Time's up! Now hurry up and go back to sleep! Behave yourself, all right? Don't get me wrong. I don't care what happens to you. Just don't cause me any trouble. To reiterate, just so we're clear, you will immediately be expelled if you cause any problems. Honestly, I hesitated on accepting someone like you. But there were some circumstances on our side. You might have done a variety of things in hiding in your hometown but you will behave yourself here. If you are thrown out from our school, there will be no place for you to go. Keep that in mind. This is the teacher in charge of your class. I'm Sadayo Kawakami. Here's your student ID. Be sure to read the school rules. Any violations will send you straight to the guidance office. And if by chance you cause any problems, I won't be able to protect you at all. That is your promise, yes, Principal Kobayakawa? Mm-hmm. He is responsible for all his actions. But really, though, why me? There should have been better candidates. It was a sudden transfer, and your class was the only one that had an opening. If you're done explaining things, mind if we get going? I got a store to get back to. Sakura-san, please keep a close eye on him. Don't let him cause any trouble outside. Well... I'll be sure to have a serious talk about the situation he's in. <sighs> Come to the faculty office when you arrive at school tomorrow. I'll show you to your classroom. some situation. I can't believe they pushed someone with a record on me. A male teacher would be better suited for this. Why in the world was someone like that admitted here? Who knows? It was the principal's decision. I was told that it's for the school's reputation. I would have thought that my volleyball team has contributed more than enough to cover that. That's certainly true. Be careful, okay? Then again, if anything were to happen, I'd kick out a student like that right away. Well, I keep wishing that he'd just end up not coming to school. Still, that isn't something I should be saying as a teacher. 
Well, I should be returning to practice. Oh, right. The tournament's coming up, isn't it? <laughs> Having such high expectations placed on you by others is quite a problem in itself. We'll have to work hard to make up for the track team, too. Yes, that's true. Why'd it have to be my class? Oh, traffic's not moving at all. You're taking the train starting tomorrow. So, how was it? The school, I mean. Think you can manage? <sighs> Do you even understand your situation? Still, you were expelled once already. <laughs> to think you'd re-enroll at a different one. It's not like anyone will be sympathetic with you. <sighs> That's what it was like at school. People might say stuff about me in the future, too. What a troublesome kid I've taken in. I was asked to do it, and I just happened to agree to it. Uh, I've already been paid for it, too, after all. Yeah. A subway has derailed at Shibuya Station, greatly affecting the timetable all across the... Oh, another accident. So that's why it's so crowded. There's been a lot of those lately. The inbound train will soon be arriving at platform number one. Please wait behind the yellow line. to the police, the engineer's life was not in danger despite his injuries. After questioning, even he could not explain his high speed when approaching the station. No further comments were made. Police are still looking for a plausible motive. It's less of an operating accident and more of a crime of the company and the government. Site inspectors apparently reported all of this six months ago. The deterioration of the tracks and the ATC. Seems a railway company and the Ministry of Transport both turned a blind eye to the truth. There's no way they can hide. This will go all the way to the top. Now on to our main story. With this derailment accident, as well as other recent incidents of unknown motive, concern is spreading among the general public. Just what could be causing such a drastic change so suddenly in these people? SNN has Everything's linked. That's what you're thinking, correct? Hmm. Oh well. Are you free? You and I haven't gone for a drink in a while. Thank you, sir. But I have another meeting to attend. I must be going. I was I was ready to go for this meeting, and that's when this extremely fast train just came crashing in. Oh man, I thought I was gonna die. A noisy subway platform filled with people was suddenly. Did you ask for me? Is it a case? Not quite. I want your opinion on something. Sure. Your judgment is quite often correct, though. Can we discuss this over sushi, perhaps? You are making a student work late, after all. Conveyor belt only. Huh. about a gruesome accident. 80 people were involved. It's a diary. Make sure you write in it. 
You may be under probation, but there's no special limitations on what you do in particular. Besides following the law, that is. However, I'm obligated to report on you, which is why I'm having you record your daily activities. Hey, what's up? I'm about to leave right now. Don't worry. I'll be there in no time. Uh -huh. I'll see you soon. Well, I'm off. I'll lock the place up. So do whatever you want for the rest of the night. Oh, but don't mess up my store. If something goes missing, I'll hand you right over to the cops. You got school tomorrow. You better head off to bed, all right? I should write something.
Oh, man. Did it say it was going to rain today? Huh? It's raining outside? It just started all of a sudden. This is why I hate the early spring. It reminds me. Did he take an umbrella? Hmm? Who are you talking about? <laughs> Don't mind me. So, what'll it be? One house blend, please. The effects of yesterday's subway accident continues on today, as various lines suffer delays and... There's been a lot of nasty accidents lately. You know, I mean the subway accident that the news is talking about. My coworker got caught up in it and is in the hospital now. But that aside, it's kind of creepy. The people who caused these accidents supposedly went crazy all of a sudden. I heard that some of them suffered from nervous breakdowns during interrogation. Huh. Morning. You want me to give you a ride to school? You're gonna be late. Um, sure. Thank you. Do you need a lift too? Huh? Nah.
What do you want? You planning on ratting me out to Kamashita? Huh? In that car just now, it was Kamoshida. He does whatever the hell he wants. Who does he think he is, the king of a castle? Don't you agree? No, I, I mean... Hmm? Wait, you don't know Kamoshida? Are you for real? You're from Shujin, right? You messing with me? You're wearing a Shujin uniform. Huh. A second year, huh? We're the same grade then. Never seen you before, though. Oh. You a transfer student? <laughs> then no wonder you don't know him. This rain ain't too bad. We better hurry up or we'll be late. Ah. Ah. Oh. My head hurts. Damn it. I want to go home. There was a terrible subway accident that day. You remember it, don't you? I assume you know of the uproar that the public calls the psychotic breakdown incidents. That can't possibly be true. It was all over the news and one of the victims included a teacher at your high school. I've no doubt you heard about it. On that day, were you still an ordinary student? Let me change the question. You transferred to Shujin Academy, correct? An ordinary prep school that could be found in any city. That's what it should have been. What happened around that time? Tell me everything, truthfully. Should be. It said Shujin on the gate. What's going on here? Out of service. Where did we end up? The sign was for the school, right? Right? You saw it too! Jeez, you freaked me out. Who are you? You a student? Man, your costume's impressive. Is that armor real? Come on, don't just stand there, say something. Hey, what's going on? You really think so? This shit's real. C calm down, it's time out, man. We gotta run. Yeah, we better not mess with him. Go! Yeah. What's with these guys? You, 
You're gonna break my bones, damn it! The hell you think you're. Gah! Take them away! Hey, hey, hey. Hey, wake up! You all right? I see. Looks like this ain't no dream. Gah, what's going on? Hey, let us out of here. I know there's someone out there. Damn it. Where are we? Is this some kind of TV set? What the hell was that just now? Whoa, 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 whoa! You're shitting me, right? Come on, man. your punishment has been decided upon. Your charge is unlawful entry. Thus, you will be sentenced to death. Say what? No one's allowed to do as they please in my castle. Huh? Wait, is that you, Kamoshida? I thought it was some petty thief, but to think it'd be you, Sakamoto. Are you trying to disobey me again? Looks like you haven't learned your lesson at all, huh? And you brought a friend this time. Because you can't do anything for yourself. This ain't funny, you asshole! Is that how you speak to a king? It seems you don't understand the position you're in at all. Not only did you sneak into my castle, you committed the crime of insulting me, the king! The punishment for that is death. It's time for an execution! Take him out! Stop it! God damn it! I ain't down for this shit! Come on, we're out of here! Just go! Get out of here! These guys are serious! Uh oh Running away, are we? What a heartless friend you are. He ain't a friend. Come on, hurry up and go! What's the matter? Too scared to run away? <laughs> Pathetic scum isn't worth my time. I'll focus on this one's execution. Take this! Lowly scum! Useless <laughs> pass! Huh. Where'd your energy from earlier go? A peasant like you isn't worth beating. I'll have you killed right now. Hmm. <laughs> what? Don't you dare tell me you don't know who I am. That look in your eyes irritates me. Hold him there. After the peasant, it's his turn to die. No, no I don't want to die. <laughs> this is truly an unjust game. Your chances of winning are almost none. But if my voice is reaching you, 
There may yet be a possibility open to you. What's the matter? Are you simply going to watch? Are you forsaking him to save yourself? Death awaits him if you do nothing. Was your previous decision a mistake then? Very well. I have heeded your resolve. willing to perform all sacrilegious acts for thine own justice. Call upon my name and release thy rage. Show the strength of thy will to ascertain all on thine own. Though thou be chained to hell itself. Execute him. What was that? You desire to be killed that much? Fine. within you. If you so desire, I shall consider granting you the power to break through this crisis. Hmm. Very well. Who the hell are you? Guard! Start by killing that one! You'll learn the true strength of my men! Change that animosity into power, and unleash it! Persona! Ravage them! Swing your blade! You see your fire! That's it! This power of mine! It's yours! Kill them however you want. Run wild to your heart's content! Sona! There! I leveled up. Just now. 
You little... <laughs> you like that, you son of a bitch? You mean this? Okay, it's locked. Damn you! Hey, what was that just now? And your clothes? Whoa, they went back to normal. You bastards! God, this is effing nuts. Anyways, let's scram. You lead the way. Goddamn thieves! After them! Don't let them escape! What is this thing? You're not soldiers of this castle, right? Get me out of here! Look, the key's right there! We're trying to get the hell out of here. I mean, you obviously look like an enemy, too. I'm locked up here, so how can I be your enemy? Help me out! I am not a cat! Say that again and I'll make you regret it! up already shit there's still no service ain't there any way to contact someone outside how the hell do we get out hey you do you want to know where the exit is let me out and i'll take you there you don't want to get caught and executed right i never go back on my word this thing sounds like it's all talk if you guys think you can get out on your own, then be my guest. What do we do? Are you seriously not messing with us? If you don't hurry, they'll catch you. Fine. Uh, uh, freedom tastes so great. Now where's the exit, you monster cat? Don't call me a cat. I am Morgana. Shut up and hurry it up! You want to be locked up again? Oh, all right! Sheesh! Follow me and stay quiet. Jeez.
Oh, shit! Oh, shit, it's them! You amateur! Stay still! Hey, you! You can fight, right? Let's go! Come! You got one of those things, too? We will promptly shut them up! Damn shadows. They've taken up intercept positions. It means they're holding nothing back and are serious to kill us. I'll back you up, so fight like your life depends on it. Let's go! Come! Ravage them! Hm. I knew you were an amateur. This is how you fight! Zero! Strike at an enemy's weakness to knock them down. Use that opening to strike again! That's the most basic of basics. Remember it well! Come on, let's hurry and get through this! Persona! through me. Okay. Another tool for our mission. Oh. Come on, man. What did you say?
We're here. Oh, finally, we're saved. It's not opening. Did you trick us, you jerk? Don't jump to conclusions. Over here. Hey, wait up. Where are we supposed to get out from here? There aren't even any windows. Oh, amateur. This is the most basic of basics. That's right. As I thought, you're a natural at this. It leads all the way outside. I see. Then we just gotta get that metallic mesh off. And a one, and a... Ah! Oh, crap. The enemy didn't hear us, did they? Seriously, we're finally getting out of here! You should wait on celebrating until you actually get out. Now get going! But what about you? There's something that I still have to do. We're going our separate ways. <laughs> You've got manners. Be careful on your way. Those two seem useful. Especially the frizzy-haired one, if my judgment's right. <sighs> Did we make it? You have returned to the real world. Welcome back. Huh? Returned? Does that mean we got away? <laughs> I don't know what to think anymore. What was all that anyways? That castle and, and Kamoshida and that weird cat? What the hell's going on? What's with the yelling? Are you students of Shujin? Cutting classes, are we? Huh? Uh, no. We were trying to get to school and we ended up at this weird castle. <sighs> what? Oh, hand over your bag. You better not be doing any drugs. Why would you think that? Are you his friend? Then you should go to school. Take him with you. Like I'm trying to say, I don't know what's going on either. We passed by Shujin on our way here. There was nothing out of the ordinary about it. If you spout any more nonsense, I'll contact your school. Is that what you want? Come on, say something. Uh, that's not what I meant. W wait a sec. Is that guy for real? Fine, I'm going. A Minister of Transport announcing his resignation. <laughs> Things are going as planned. Sai Nijima. That reminds me. <sighs> Better to leave it be for now. Is this for real? I'm sure we came the same way. I, what's going on here? That's exactly what I wanted to ask you. We received a call from the police. The damn cops snitched on us after all. Hmm. It's rare not to see you alone. Where were you roaming around until this time? Uh... A, ca a castle? So you have no intention of giving an honest answer. What's this about a castle? Kamoshida? You seem so carefree, Sakamoto. Quite a difference from when you did morning practice for the track team. Shut up! It's your fault that it... How dare you speak that way to Mr. Kamoshida? <sighs> There's not much leeway left for you, you know? He's the one that provoked me! 
Do you really want to be expelled? In any case, you'll have to explain yourself. Follow me. What? This is bullshit! Come now. I should have been more considerate, too. Let's just say that we were both to blame. Well, if you say so. Still, you're coming with me. It's undeniable that you're extremely late. Fine. By the way, you're that new transfer student, correct? Have we met somewhere? That's right. I remember now. Well, I'll overlook this just for today. I'm sure you've heard from the principal. But cause any trouble and you'll be expelled. Understand? At any rate, hurry up and go to the faculty office. I'm sure Ms. Kawakami's tired of waiting. Good luck trying to enjoy your new school life. The school turned into an old castle? A talking cat? Are you hallucinating from an overdose? I won't put up with you if you're simply joking around. I'm going to have you continue the story. The one who received a calling card from the Phantom Thieves was an Olympic medalist. An alumnus from Shujin Academy. The PE teacher Suguru Kamoshida. It's true that what he did were deplorable crimes from... indulging his desire. He confessed to it all. But there should have been no connection between the two of you since you had just transferred. Why did you target him? That's unacceptable! Try and recall it once again. over half a day late on your first day? Can you explain yourself? How could you have been lost for this long? It's almost lunchtime. Well, it's probably true that you're not used to the area yet, but you're still way too late. Will you pull yourself together? You were given fair warning yesterday. More importantly, I heard that you were caught along with that Sakamoto-kun. get involved with him, okay? He's nothing but trouble. He wasn't like that when he was devoting his time to track and field, though. Anyway, break's almost over. Classes will end after fifth period today because of the subway accident. I'll have you introduce yourself when class resumes. Follow me. By the way, when you introduce yourself, be serious about it, even if you're lying to the class, okay? Do not say anything unnecessary. You think that's him? Huh? The one in the rumors? Being super late on his first day? He really is insane. He looks normal, though. But he might slug us if we look him in the eye. <sighs> Settle down. Well, I'd like to introduce a transfer student. Today we had him attend from the afternoon on since he wasn't feeling well. All right, please say something to the class. He seems quiet. 
<laughs> but I bet when he loses it... I mean, he was arrested for assault, right? Uh, so... Your seat will be... Hmm, over there, the one that's open. Sorry, but can the people nearby please share your textbooks with him for today? Ugh, this sucks. Hmm. Lies. <sighs> Did you catch that? Do those two know each other? Ooh, does that mean he hit on her before transferring here? That means she's cheating on him with Mr. Kamoshida. Then again, this is Takamaki-san we're talking about. For real, that side of the room is totally awful. Oh right, the volleyball rallies in two days. Everyone's just changed classes, so make sure you use that time to get to know each other. Well then, let's get class started. Who's on duty today? Everyone, please rise. What's wrong? Are you sure you're okay? Also, it seems like people are already talking about you, but I'm not the one who told them. I can't even catch a break. Why do I have to deal with this? You should head straight home without stopping by anywhere. Sakura-san sounded pretty angry. Oh, and about Sakamoto-kun, don't get involved. Speak of the devil. What do you want? I heard the police caught you cutting classes today. <sighs> it was nothing. And you haven't dyed your hair back to black, either. Sorry about that. I'll be waiting on the rooftop. <sighs> See? That's why I don't want you getting involved. Understood? Why did you allow a student like him to transfer here? He's already started associating with Sakamoto. A student with a criminal record and the culprit of an assault case. At this rate, it'd be pointless how much I contribute to the school. Now don't be like that. This school counts on you, Kamoshiro-kun. You are our star. Still, a steady build-up is necessary behind such brilliance as well. Your troubles never seem to end, do they, Principal Kobayakawa? All right, I understand. I'll continue to do my best to answer your expectations of me. you are. Sorry for calling you up here like this. I bet Kawakami already told you stuff like don't get involved with him, huh? <laughs> I thought you'd say that. I heard you got a criminal record. Everyone's talking about it. No wonder you were so gutsy. What was all that that happened? You know, how we almost got killed at a castle. It wasn't a dream, right? You remember it too, yeah? Well, just because we both remember it doesn't mean much, though. I mean, even if it was a dream, you saved me from Kamoshida. So yeah, uh, thanks. But man, that Kamoshida we saw there. You probably don't know about it, but there are some rumors about him. 
Yeah, the ripped mop head. That asshole who was all full of himself at the castle. No one says anything against him because he's some medalist who took the volleyball team to nationals. The way Kamashita was king of that castle felt crazy real because of that. I wonder if we can go back to that castle again. Ah, forget it. It must have all been a dream. It has to be. Sorry to drag you out here like this. That's all I had to say. You know, we might be pretty similar. I feel like we're gonna get along just fine as troublemakers. I'm Ryuji Sakamoto. I'll come talk if I see you around. Don't ignore me, all right? See ya. About time you've come to! On your feet, inmate! Our master wishes to speak with you. It's for your own sake that you take his words to heart. First off, let us celebrate our reunion. Oh, you've awakened to your powers, and special ones at that. Your rehabilitation can finally begin. There is no need to understand it all for the time being. You will be training the power of Persona, which you have awakened to. Personas are, in other words, a mask, an armor of the heart when confronting worldly matters. I have high expectations for you. You have no choice but to hone your strength. It's not because we're forcing you. But because this is your fate, neglect it and you will die. By the by, have you come to appreciate the Metaverse Navigator? Using it will allow you to come and go between reality and palaces. I bestowed it to you as a means to train you as a thief. The Metaverse Navigator is a gift from our master. You better take care in using it, inmate. Devote yourself to your training so that you may become a fine thief. It must be disheartening to make use of the Metaverse Navigator alone. Should there be others who would prove beneficial to you, I will grant it to them as well. This is all for you to grow as a most excellent thief. <laughs> it's time. Go back and enjoy whatever rest you might have. Seriously? Uh, what's going on? Ayama Inchon. 
I'll just add this. 